Owen filled me in on what happened. You've got a problem out there. Some kind of Dominion Heavy. His people called him the Monitor. We couldn't stop him. And he was there for a Shaper Relic? Tore the place apart. Your agent wouldn't give in. Right to the end, she... Well... I know. I'm sorry. She left this archive behind. We'll have my people dig into it. The Dominion really have returned. In force. Damn. I thought spies took everything in stride. We also respect our enemies. Life under Dominion rule isn't much of a life at all. And if they have set their sights on Fort Tarsus... Right. Well, uh, the fort isn't exactly my idea of living the dream, but it is home, and I'd prefer it to remain dictator-free. What can we do? For now, remain patient. I don't want to make a move until I have more information. In the meantime, there's someone I'd like you to meet. Sentinel Bryn. She's sharp, trustworthy, and could use some assistance. Why don't you help her while I look into the Dominion? I'll be in touch. Sentinel Rissa Bryn. Fort Command. Sentinel. How can we help? Well, uh, we probably shouldn't talk here. Come see me by my desk. And my plants. Plants? Right. So, uh, good. I will see you. Okay, then. Freelancer, how's it going? It's Matthias Sumner checking in. By the way, I finally cleared out the clutter from my lab, so I can resume my work. I'll be there, if you need to talk. Freelancer. Hello. Sentinel. Good to see you again. Is it? I isn't it? I don't associate much with freelancers. Okay. Or anyone not a Sentinel, really. Well, I hope you don't regret getting to know one of us. Yes, me too. <laughs> okay. Can I help you with something? Yes. Well, quietly. I don't technically have permission from my superiors to be contracting you. But there's been an unusual amount of scar activity around nearby Arcanus base. Whatever it is, it could be dangerous if the scars get hold of it. Agreed. I'll check it out for you. Good. I mean, good luck, freelancer. Right. No problem. Hey. I can't believe I'm talking to you. You're like the most badass freelancer in Fort Tarsus. My name's Neeson. Hello. Hey, aren't you teamed up with that cypher, Owen? Yeah, why? 
Yeah, no reason. I just thought you might be concerned about that cypher school thing of his. What are you talking about? Okay, all right, maybe I shouldn't be telling you this, but I heard he got over-altered during his training. Over-altered? Yeah, I guess it glitched him up pretty bad. What are you talking about? Oh, I can't say for sure, but that's what people are saying, and you gotta admit, Owen is a little goofy. No, he's not. Yeah, no, I don't think so either. Just telling you what I heard. Thanks, but that kind of information isn't useful. Yeah, I get it. You already knew. But if you ever need any info on anyone else in the fort, I'm pretty plugged in. Yeah, no thanks. No need to close that door. I, let's just agree to maybe meeting in the future. Or let's not. Yeah, I got you. Catch you later. Looking good, freelancer. Welcome to my store. Browse away. Good timing. We just got some excellent new stuff.
Dispatching in Sentinel Bryn. Freelancer. Hello again. Sentinel Bryn here. Hi. Hi again, Sentinel. How are you? Fine, fine. The Arctic space isn't far from your location. Keep an eye out for scores. Will do. Uh, since this is our first mission, maybe we should talk, get to know each other? No, let's not. I'll let you know when you're close to the base. All right. Missing Arcanist machinery. And for whatever else they might have been working on. Watch out for scars while you're at it. Not much around except broken sheep or bits. No signs of Arcanists. We'll keep looking. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Sure, they just leave it lying around. Okay. Well, if you don't see anything arcanist y, they probably got hit it. So I should look for some kind of scar shed? Uh, sure. How about a scar cave instead of a scar shed? I can work with it. Well, there's one near you. Good place to hide stolen machinery. I'll find it and head in. I would hope so, yes.
hiding the stuff pile would be somewhat creepy like this. Any advice? Eliminate them and find it. Blunt but fair. as the stolen Arcanist machinery is connected to a Shaper relic. That's not good. Stop them before it goes volatile. Reassemble it! 
Agni's shield of General Tarsus. Were those scars deliberately trying to force a Shaper artifact to create scorpions? Maybe? That's so strange. They normally just scavenge. Operative report, and, um... Uh, thank you. Great answer. This was a huge help to the Sentinels and to the Fort. Nice. Working with you, too. Yes. Well, maybe we'll work together again sometime. Maybe. See you around, then. Let's see what I can do.
My savior. And the reason Scars aren't feasting on my liver right this minute. Bloody Scars. The spike in their activity has really thrown off my research. What are you working on, exactly? I'm looking for a lost Arcanist text known as the Elysian Manuscript. It was inscribed by early members of our order and has been lost for generations. Some Arcanists believe that their writings could help us predict the behavior of Shaper instruments. Imagine knowing Ferelic will create firestorms or scorpions or shatter you into a thousand pieces. We could keep people safe. Indeed. Every little piece of knowledge we can scrape together helps. You're making progress? The heroic work done by my assistants, may they continue to seek answers beyond this life, led to a discovery. Turns out there was a far more ingenious way to pass knowledge along. Invisible runes. Invisible? Runes, yes. How do I... Aha, I picked your curiosity. You'll just have to continue on this adventure to find out, won't you? My... Uh... Our research has revealed a potential site that may answer our questions. Just point me in the right direction. Hi again, Bren. Freelancer. Hello again. Hi. While I have you, we need more information about this odd scar activity. If you have time to lend the Sentinels a hand. On it. Just pass on the details when you have them. Yes. Will do. Ah, my new friend. You listened well to my story of Freemark, huh? Never heard it told like that. I was long retired. The battle was not mine to fight. But good friends tell me. I was a freelancer for many years. You know what freelancers do. We deal with things beyond the wall. Problems. We help people. Truth, but it's not so small as that. We explore. We fight chaos. We save lives. You hear me? Okay, I hear you. People could count on us. In this world, a big deal. But that has been lost. People don't trust us. Hard times now. But enough gloom. Got a contract for you. Going to protect some Arcanists doing seismic tests, okay? Seismic tests? Yeah, check to see if Fort Tarsus has strong foundation. Don't want it to fall into a hole like last time. What? But these tests attract animals. The kind with teeth, you know? You protect one side of the fort, and Freelancer Rife will protect the other. You hear me? I hear you. Good. Now go. I'm hungry. No breakfast yet. I plan to head up to the wall. Well, hello. Uh-oh. What's going on? You scare me a little sometimes. Do I? <laughs> Actually, I suppose that's fair. I do peddle in danger. Still, you should know me better than that. I know you. Okay, when's my birthday? Ah, uh, trick question. You don't like celebrating birthdays. So, when is my birthday? I think you're having me on. You've, you've never told me. Probably not. It was a number of days ago. Ah, well then, uh, happy belated birthday. Thank you. So, where's my gift? I tell you what, I'll write you a terrible poem. How does that sound? Some... some time. Actually, the day we met was my birthday. Haha! <laughs> now that is a trick. <laughs> what, which time? Recently or in, uh, in our youth? Youth? The time you picked my pocket. <laughs> well, I was starving. Or bored. More bored? Which turned out well, actually. 
briefing regulators through, it was pretty fun. You were always looking for trouble. Is that what made you want to be a freelancer, do you think? Not a bad observation. Thrills come in many forms. Ha <laughs> ha, which is what I like about you. You never back away from a thrill that I present you. It's fun. Trouble can be fun. And the fact that it's a job that pays? Bonus. Say, back then, what were you doing alone in Pontex anyway? I was tired of the Satomi and was taking, well, shall we say, an unscheduled break. Roaming. That's what I was doing, roaming. Same thing you were doing when we met in Heliost. I like to think of it more as finding myself. Because of the Heart of Rage. Where's your team? I don't know. Yeah, I brought you down. Well, never mind. There's a bright future ahead. Cheer up. Contracts await. Lucky Jack. Keep him busy. You know it. Just had a contract dealing with scars. I show up and they're messing with a relic. Good thing some buddies jump on the call. We've got elementals swarming, scars everywhere, then a love-struck Korox shows up. What happened? Teamwork, fancy flying, and one heck of a lucky shot. Next thing I know, the relic's silent, the Korox has a new friend, and we come out all right. Starting to see where you got the nickname. It could have gone straight sideways, I'm telling you, but that's what family's for. Stronger together, right? It's the best way to survive. Nice to have company, too. More eyes, more ears. And more witnesses when you do something awesome. Like dealing with love-struck Koroks. It's not something you forget. Just for scheduling the next job was easy. Is there a problem? My buddies and I thought we'd team up on another contract. Last one went well, so why not, right? Now they can't agree which job to take. I just want something logged in the pending contracts report. What are your options? An arcanist looking for a lost vault. Gotta love some mystery. Or the fort needs people to take on hostile wildlife. Guaranteed action there. Do you really want to pass up a chance to uncover lost secrets? That's what makes the job exciting, isn't it? All right, buddy. Using you as the tiebreaker. Wish me luck. I'm not sure you need it. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you around. Trust these new freelancers. Why not? Good, they're trying to come back. Freelancers died out.
Patching in Freelancer Yarrow. Yarrow here. Let's see if we can keep some arcanists alive, yes? Freelancer Wright has begun her patrol. This is Wright. As the man says, I'm on my way. Let's see what we can do, Wright. Seismic indicator is ready to go, okay? Start it up. I hate this part. Always makes me nervous. Remember, these tests attract animals. Don't know why. Make sure the Arcanists stay healthy, you understand? Got it. I'll keep an eye out. Of animals incoming. You see? Every time. So angry. signatures in the area. Yes, I'm 
I'm seeing a lot of munitions around here. Take care of them. The arcanists were found. The scars brought a cage. A cage!
Yeah, there's no sign of the Arcanists or right. Search the area. Find them.
I don't know why, but the scars are capturing arcanists. We need them back. I'll see what I can do. Arcanists are in this area, Freelancer. Scars hurt them. recover their signets. safely.
Scars from just got a pair of new leaders. We should kill them before they make trouble. On it.
Patching in Arcanist Matthias. So how did you learn about where we're headed? From very old field notes. There was something the writer wasn't saying. Something important they didn't write down. I'm certain of it. So you had a hunch. A hypothesis. Right. What secrets must they hold? Let's find out. Something other arcanists can recognize. create a big enough change, the wires detect it, the marker triggers. Like a fire alarm? Exactly. That shaper object across from the marker is made for echoes. Got it. Let's build a fire. It's working, but the marker won't trigger with a larger shift in energy. More echoes needed. So many echoes required. This site was chosen to make this task difficult. They just needed Arcanists working with freelancers. Of course. How'd you learn about these hidden rooms we're looking for? The moment I realized the great need for secrecy in our history, it opened up new ways to look at the research I already had. Attracted some slimy friends. Ah, oh, yes. Unpleasant. They're fascinating creatures, but only from very far away. Behind a wall, with the lights on.
should be close. Matthias, how did you do this work without freelancer help? Slowly. My fears and associate. Slowly. This task alone will certainly require many uncomfortable nights in the jungle. This book you're looking for. The Elysian Manuscript. Right. Um, what do you think you'll find in there? Find? Well, Marketists pursue the truth, but time twists the truth, hides it. The manuscript is a window to a very old truth.
on it? The marker's been triggered. The Arcanist fire alarm. Precisely.
Hey there, it's me. Owen? We need to chat. It's important. Meet me in the bar. Okay, I'll be there. Owen? Huh. Freelancer. What's up? Saving the world. Uh, uh... Never mind. Rhetorical question. Sorry, I'm a little cranky. Strider full of rations and batteries I ordered was jumped by regulators. How much did you lose? Can you get more? Maybe. I'll need more money first. And that means more contracts. Not easy to come by. Yeah. I just wish... I mean, I was born here. Fort Tarsus used to be great. People used to look down on the fort because it wasn't Antium or Fremark. But I think it was better. But you were a kid. Exactly. My brother Kismet and I used to climb that scaffolding just to watch the Striders come and go. Then the market would fill up with happy people and cool things to buy. It even seemed sunnier. Hmm, might be my imagination. Though it was before the harder age. So, poor Fort Tarsus. It's kind of a crap heap now. Not sure why I keep coming back. It's hard to give up on home, even if you should know better. You're right. Does that make me foolish? Is it okay if I don't answer that? Huh. Well, everything I own is on the other side of these doors. Looks like I'm stuck here. But you should save yourself. Okay. Good luck. I'm Freelancer Johnny, by the way. See you around. Freelancer, I'm hearing good things. You, you cheat. Watch where you fling those accusations. Hey, buddy, you're getting it done out there. You saying that in general or? <laughs> Owen's quick to brag. Not that you haven't earned it, right? I couldn't do this without Owen. Keep it up and they'll be talking about us all over Bastion. You're raising our name. We're getting more offers. I've started color coding the ledgers. It's beautiful. What about you? Any exciting jobs? Well, besides paperwork? Remember that arcane vault job my buddies and I took? How'd it go? We fly out there and my cipher picks up the vault's location. But it's locked. My buddies and I split up to find the tuning points that will crack it. There's grabbits hopping around. Nice and quiet. You wouldn't be building this up if it stayed that way. <laughs> yeah, okay. We pop the vault open, but we've attracted Wolven. No problem, we have what we came for. Just take off, right? My one buddy, his kid sister loves that radio show about the crime fight in Grabbit, Detective Hop's Mysteries. He's going on that we can't let Hops die, what'll he tell the kid, and I can't say I'm not with him. Next thing you know, I'm booking it with a grabbit in my arms while the other two are flying back to the Arcanist. Now that's one to remember. Wouldn't have done it without your tie-breaking boat. Something tells me the job would have been interesting either way. You never know, eh? I <laughs> guess not. See you around, Jack. Ah, very good work out there with the Arcanists. People want to believe freelancers have their backs. After Freemark, belief hard to come by. Glad I could help. How's Freelancer Rife doing? Good. She put up a hell of a fight. Of course. She knows I would be angry to write her story for the wall. But, my young friend, she is alive. This is a good story to tell. People will hear of it. Think that'll help around here? Oh, yes. Now, Rife is recovering at the bar if you want to check on her. I will keep an eye out for contracts, never fear.
Had some visitors in today. New to Fort Tarsus. Curious about Freeland. Oh, so soon? Good. I have contracts for you. To change minds around here, we need to get out there and do good work. Remind people they can count on us. You hear me? I hear you. Kind of mar hey, good to see you. You're a freelancer, right? I think you knew that. I never assume. Like, I'm a laundryman now, right? But not very long ago, I was a cleaning guy. I figured you were like me, always on the move. We're not that alike. Sure we are. Anyway, you know Yarrow, right? That super old freelancer? Sure, I know Yarrow. You think you know him, but did you hear about him in the Tesselar? No, but I have a feeling you're going to tell me. Yes. So, I guess a long time ago, he was guarding some families, and a kid got too close to a Tesselar burrow. It all happened so fast that to save the child's life, Yarrow had no choice but to choke the Tesselar to death with his bare hands. But Tesselars emit an electrical charge. Yarrow would have at least been knocked out. Yeah, but... I guess he held on, even though he was unconscious. Why wasn't he in his javelin? I think it was really hot out. Javelins compensate for temperatures. Uh, you know, you're wrecking this story, right? Oh, I was just trying to understand how he did it. Trust me, he did it, okay? That's why he talks so funny. He does? Uh, yeah. Have you ever talked to him? Yes. <laughs> you have? I tried to once, but he was, uh, he was too busy. Hey, do you have time for lunch? I don't think so. Yeah, I mean, we're both so busy, huh? That's hell. All right, I'll see you around. Hi again. Freelancer. Uh, fancy meeting you here. <laughs> Were you trying to make a joke, Bryn? I'm attempting something new. I don't think I enjoyed it. I should tell you, I'm impressed with how you've handled yourself on missions. Freelancers. We get the job done. Sometimes. From what I've heard. You asked me for help, and now you're insulting me. Uh, 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 sorry, uh, I apologize. You're right. I've just always thought of freelancers in a certain way. Well, let me guess. Unreliable mercenaries with a recruitment problem? Close enough. Though that doesn't describe you so far. How do you even have an opinion of freelancers if I'm the first one you've worked with? Hmm. From radio shows and other Sentinels. Have you ever considered Sentinel life? They've asked. I've never been tempted. Really? Really. You seem good at what you do, but it's too many rules and regs for me. <laughs> oh, rules and regs keep the world in order. A place for everything. Sounds like you used that line before. My mother's favorite. She was a sentinel, too. And she also loved rules. Isn't working with freelancers without permission breaking those rules? If the sentinels don't adapt, the fort won't be around much longer to protect. And isn't that adapting, just breaking the rules with purpose? Now you're just talking nonsense. I'll see you around. Potentially.
Hey, you're a freelancer, right? I've heard things about you. What kind of things? Some of the Arcanists said you stopped a cataclysm. Or a giant Ursix? Or both? That was me, yeah. It was uh, kind of both. Interesting. You're one to watch. I don't want to say too much just yet, but be mindful. A lot of eyes will be on you soon. What does that mean? It means this is the time to show what you're made of. You've got a contract for me. I'm happy to hear it. Not a contract, exactly. Have you ever heard of the path to glory? It's like a ranking of Lancers, right? That's not all it is. There are certain rewards offered to those on the path. Rewards offered by who, exactly? The Emperor. Put yourself on the path, Freelancer. What you do will matter, I promise. Looks like this is your lucky day. Why's that? You just bumped into the oldest man in Fort Tarsis. Name's Jarek. Nice to meet you. You too. You know, you don't live as long as I have without seeing some things. Yeah? Like what? I was there when the scars swarmed the fort's terraces. It was a bloodbath. Happened over 50 years ago, and it feels like yesterday. I was also there when the scars came over the walls. What do you think about that? I think you've seen a lot. You bet I have. More than you ever will, that's for sure. I hope you're right. Oh, I am, Freelancer. I've lived a life filled with bloodshed and disaster. I've survived Strider ambushes, Dominion attacks and outlaws. I've even run from Wyverns. I've seen enough death the last 50 lifetimes. And yet, somehow, I'm still kicking. So what's your secret to survival? It ain't no secret. I'm a pragmatist. I always did what I had to in order to survive. I'm sorry. You must have lost many people along the way. You got that right. I've outlived every friend I ever had. Sometimes I wonder if I made the right choices. I was in a mining crew digging for ore near Heliost when the main shaft collapsed. We were trapped behind a solid wall of rock. We had no idea of how long it would take for the rescue party to dig us out. I was lucky enough to find a bottle of water. But there were six of us. One bottle of water for six miners? How many of you made it out? I was the only survivor. You're tough as nails. That's why it's still alive. I guess so. You guess? How else does one man live while five perish? I just did what I had to do. So what exactly did you have to do? If I'd have shared that water, nobody would have lived. So you chose to let five people die to save yourself? I told you, I'm a pragmatist. I guess that's why you're the oldest man in Fort Tarsus. Don't you judge me. You've seen death. You've done things. I can see it in your eyes. It's usually a glint of sadness or knowledge, but in some people, that glint turns into a gleam. And a gleam means they want to see more death. Be careful, Freelancer. I still see a glint in your eyes. The right tool for the right job. How hard is that to understand? Thank you. For what? For stepping close so you don't impede foot traffic. You were off to the side, so it seemed to make sense. My apologies. I assumed you would recognize me from one of my public safety forums. Sorry, I was not aware those were happening. My name is Perndal Blatch, and I'm the Fort Custodian. 
I maintain and improve all public works and spaces. Sounds like a big job. It's enormous. I'm seeking public input on an initiative to improve life in Fort Tarsus. Would you care to take part? My might. Excellent. Please answer the following questions. Do you A, believe the fort needs immediate improvements to function more efficiently, or B, recognize the fort has glaring inefficiencies that must be corrected? Aren't those statements both the same? No. One suggests immediate action, and the other identifies issues, then proposes solutions. I'm not sure the fort wants to change. The fort must change. It's unsafe in so many ways. Take the walking issue, for example. Did you say walking? Yes. People walk and stop wherever they please. This causes stoppages, bumping, and even pedestrian rage. I'm proposing we implement lanes and foot traffic rules of way. I guess it would make walking here more efficient. It will. It's just a matter of applying rewards and punishment to ensure compliance. There will be some resistance, but I've run into that before. Where at? The fountain in the courtyard. People said we didn't need it, but now I'm spearheading the campaign to restore it. How does a fountain make the fort more efficient? The fountain creates a meeting place and instills pride in the community. Happy people are more productive. Is the fountain working? Not at the moment. There's a piping issue. It was nice chatting with you. I'm off to a meeting regarding proper personal equipment in the forge area. Good luck with that. Thank you. It's not easy keeping this fort safe. It's not your fault. There's nothing more you could have done. I know. It's just... I'm sure I'm too out for me. The thought of going out there and hitting it. Take your time. Look who's back in one piece. So, did you expect me in more pieces than one? You? Never. I trust you've brought me work. Always good to give your javelin the once over after a run. What have you done this time? Nothing you can't fix. Flattery, huh? You must have done a number out there. Mm, nothing too crazy. Are we using your skill for crazy or mine? Scars, beasts, relic-based nonsense. Some people stay on this side of the wall. Others, well, since you love running into that kind of stuff, you better be careful. <laughs> 